Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. One of my most popular videos so far was What's in My Bag? I have the Danny Dover Landon carry-all. That video you guys loved. It was super popular and I am very happy that you did enjoy it. I really truly love this bag. I love it so much that I have two of them. <laughs> and this was completely by accident. My husband got me one of them for Christmas. Not 2019, but 2018. My uncle also got me the same bag. I had the choice of returning it and exchanging it for something else, but I decided to keep them both because they both serve very different purposes. One of them I use for my work bag, which you saw in the other video. I will link it over here. And the other one I have strictly for travel and getaway purposes. So this bag is very versatile as you can tell just because of the fact that I use it for those two different purposes So today I am going to be doing a, a review of this bag and why I love it and enjoy it so much My experience with it so far what my thoughts are on what I wish would be a little bit different and things like that So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started so first things first, it does come with a very nice dust bag and I always store it inside its dust bag with the bags and foam that are inside just so that it maintains its shape. But even if I didn't store it like that, it still retains its shape very well. This is my little Dagny Dover Landon carry-all. This is my travel one. As you can tell, it has a little travel tag and it's obviously a lot more pristine than my other one that I use for every day. So first thing that I really like about this bag is that you have these clasps on the side and it allows you to make it into a very nice square-ish rectangular bag. Very nice because at this size, this is the medium size, it fits perfectly under the seat in front of you inside an aircraft. So I really love it for that purpose. It allows me to keep all of my essentials in here. I oftentimes even put my purse in here so that I have, it doesn't count as a personal item and this is my personal item. I really like because it's handy. It also has a very nice and a sturdy zipper. You can use it as a crossbody duffel bag because it does have the clasp for that. It does have a nice little back pocket here that I use to put my cell phone to keep it very readily accessible and like I said I often store it with all the plastic inside so I'm gonna go ahead and remove that and it's gonna make a lot more so that stuff so the other thing that I like and this one has two but one is for each bag I just took one of the bags and stored them together but it does have this very nice pouch or it's a wet bag pouch a little bit water resistant it does have the same nice zipper you can put shoes in here you can store dirty clothes you can use it for whatever you want i've used it for both but i really like it it also has their very nice logo and then I have the other one from the other from this bag that has the nice little strap that you can hook onto your bag and then you can carry it just like that and let's dive inside I have all of the documentation for the bag I'm a neat freak and I like to keep all of those receipts just in case you never know. Inside I've shown you um, when I did my what's in my bag for my work bag. And this is the inside of the bag. So you have a compartment here with a security for your laptop. You have a zippered pouch up here at the front. You have two pouches on the side. I don't know if you can see them well, but this over here where you can put water bottles or anything that you want to keep secure and you have one on each side. And then you have a very nice wide space bag and then you also have a little mesh pouch with a strap. So I'm, I've never fully understood the purpose of these little straps. If you guys know, let me know down below. You can connect this to that and keep it safe. 
in my work bag. I just keep all of my hair ties in there. But this bag is just perfect. I probably buy more of them if I use them more often. I wish I kind of had two different colors because it would, you know, give me a little bit more diversity. But I really love this color that I have, which is their pink version. Their blue, their um, robin blue is just absolute perfection. It's beautiful. And it also comes in like a military green that I really, really like as well. So I may get more things uh, from them in the future, especially from this line. So the bag is a neoprene material. It is very water resistant. It doesn't stain. I've had mine in the rain and it doesn't have any stains. I've also spilled coffee on mine. In their instructions and on their site, they don't recommend putting it in the washing machine. Now they say to spot clean it dry uh, with a little bit of dish soap and water and a cloth. But for that coffee stain, those coffee stains, they weren't coming out and I was very upset and my husband said let's just throw it in the in the washing machine and lo and behold we put it in the washing machine and the stains came out we used just regular oxyclean and detergent warm water and it came out we let it dry kind of in the same shape we put its shape back together and it turned out normal no issues there so you can wash it you I mean, the company doesn't sponsor it, but I've done it and my work bag is just as new as this one, except that it's not as, it hasn't held its shape as much because obviously I have it filled to the brim. It's very heavy and I use it every day. In terms of traveling with it, it's very, it's very good. It doesn't, like I said, it doesn't stain easily. I put it on the floor. I've never washed this one. It's got the nice thick drafts, so it's very comfortable to wear on your arm. Just for purposes, this is how the size hits me. So this is the medium size. It hits just at the top of my hip here. It's very nice and comfortable. It looks very fashionable. You can easily rest it on your carry-on luggage. So yeah, it's very easy to open and show to TSA to put it through the machine. I don't know, I don't have any bad things to say about this bag. I guess the only thing would be that what if you have a 13 inch computer, which is the size that fits this bag, if you have it in this position with the very square shape. It's very difficult to put your computer in here. But what I normally do is I just open the sides, put my computer in and then just lock it back and then it stays nice and well shaped. I don't know, I don't know what else to say about this guys. You guys want to see everything that fits in here. You can check out my what's in my work bag video. Again, I will link it over here and in the description box down below. I did get a new item from Dagny Dover. It's called the Arlo Tech Pouch. It allows you to uh, organize all of your technology stuff in there. So let me know in the comments below or give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you want to see a review on my Arlo tech pouch and I have a little link down below. It is an affiliate link. Anyone that buys from Dagny Dover and creates an account can have one. It's not just for influencers and um, social media and celebrities or anything like that. Anyone that buys from them can get it. You get discount, I believe it's 20, 15, $25 discount and I get $25 every time you make the purchase. So that would allow me to continue buying stuff from Dagny Dober, which I will keep buying anyway because I love them. They're a great company. They were founded by women for women. It's super organization friendly and I love everything about their company. And yeah, that is it for this video, you guys. Give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter for more on my day-to-day -day life. And thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.